Hello, my name is Rich Howard, owner of Architectural Builder Supply. This video is to bring you a closer look at the AIW. This is their part number SDP 3 quarter 27 BS, brushed stainless steel. This is a, uh, what would be considered a towel bar, really. Uh, sliding door towel bar. The SDP uh, 3 quarter tells us that it's a single uh, shower door pull or sliding door pull or towel bar. The three-fourths means that it's three-quarter inch diameter. The dash 27 is the center to center between the mounting holes or the mounting points. The BS means brushed stainless. Let's take some basic dimensional properties of the item, which I have removed from the packaging. Um, let's take a look here. Oh. Okay, we missed the tool that is included uh, went missing. So. Here's the bar. This is what's called tubular. It's a tube, it's a hollow tube. Very typical and common for such items. You can also technically order these in solid brass. They may or may not be available from AIW, but they can be done in solid bar stock. They can definitely be done in solid bar stock as well. Why would you want solid bar stock? I really can't say why you might want that. Um, you know, tubular is, is, a, is a good idea. Uh, actually, I can tell you a reason why you would not want it. The added weight, you've got a, a heavy glass door hanging on a couple of hinges. Probably keeping the weight down would be advantageous. So it's something made of a tube like this would be a good idea. It has a welded in tapped disc there that the uh, bolt from the opposite side attaches to. I had said that the mounting center to center was 27 inch. Let me get our tape measure up to the center of that down here. We're going to see that we're at 27 inch. Okay, 27 inch center to center. I don't have my tape measure on the center. Now I do. So 27 inch center to center. Not common. Um, I don't know that I've sold a 27 inch for a shower door in the past. Three quarter inch diameter. Okay, and then the BS brush stainless. Now let's uh, continue on. Let's talk about the mounting package. You're going to get a couple of washers. You're going to get one bushing. There's the other washer. That's there. Just leave it on. And you'll have your bolt from the inside. Whoops. The There's a small black dot that you see there. That's actually a very small hole into which you can insert the tool, which is nothing other than a tiny Allen wrench, so that it will act as a spanner wrench. A spanner wrench allows you to get something hooked onto the circular edge of something and be able to rotate that loose, tight, whatever the case might be. That piece of Allen wrench really is just intended to act as a spanner wrench. You can get that stuck in there and just give it that final couple of very small turns, whatever you can't do with the tip of your fingers. I don't know this thread type. Um, I'm going to guess that it's metric to be sure. This material is imported from Asia. China, in fact, is what it says. So it's probably going to be a metric thread. Now, in terms of the washers, you're going to stack the washers so that none of the metal touches the glass at all. You're going to install the bushing so that the bolt does not touch the inside preparation of the, um, of the glass where you've prepped for the mounting bolts. And this is going to be compatible for doors that are um, quarter inch to half inch thick, which you're not going to find a three quarter inch thick shower door. Three quarter inch thick glass doors are reserved for exterior commercial openings. Uh, we call those Herculite doors, in fact. Uh, all glass, generally uh, either patch fittings, very little amount of material on the glass, or there can be top and bottom rails where the hardware is installed, but they're otherwise primarily glass doors. You'll see them in retail applications all the time. Uh, Manhattan is, the island of Manhattan is full of Herculite doors everywhere, as is every other major shopping area like that. This is going to be available in different finishes. Let's talk about that right now. Most certainly, it's going to be available in a polished stainless, PS, and then an ORB, oil rub bronze, is what it'll be um, available in. Let's switch now to the screen view, and let's take a closer look at the supporting information. If you are enjoying this video, please click thumbs up or like, and also please consider subscribing to our channel. Let's move on to the rest of the video. Here's the item that we are looking at. We do have some photographs that are linked to down below that we can take a closer look at. Okay, and they are right here. There's your box, 27 inch center to center. 
So that 27 inch is the center of this mounting point to the center of this mounting point. If you've got those holes at that center, this would be a bar that's eligible. Just showing you a little closer up of the detail of the finish, what it looks like, showing you some detail of, of that angle, albeit a bit blurry. The bolt and its washers and bushing removed. That threaded disc that's in there, that's been welded in. Close-up view of that. The back side of the decorative cap, your washer and busher, a uh, busher, your washers and bushing, and then your bolt, and then your tool, your Allen wrench, which acts as a spanner tool, right into that small little hole that's there. Okay, now, we do have a typo here that says 22 inch. This is definitely 27, and by the time you're seeing this video, that will be corrected. Three quarter inch tube diameter, quarter to half inch glass, half inch holes, that's an important question. Um, the OD of the bushing is probably going to be just below 3 eighths of an inch. Uh, it's not. It is about 0.405, so just below 7 sixteenths of an inch. Um, the OD of the mounting bolt, well, that's going to be 3 quarter, 0.745. So drill a half inch hole and you're going to be in real good shape with, um, have your fabricator drill a half inch hole for getting that installed. Now there's a link below this video here to the product catalog. Let's take a closer look at that. This literally is the manufacturer's full line catalog. Um, this would be better served by it just being a cut sheet and we'll make that modification. But here are all of the sizes available in these towel bars. So absolutely, most common is 24 inch, absolutely. 18 inch is the second most common. 20, 22, 26, 27, 28, these are very uncommon. I hardly ever see those sizes uh, in residential work. When it comes to commercial doors, yeah, you can have push bars that have any center to center. In fact, 29, 31 inch, 33 inch, those are all very common. Um, <clears throat> so if you're looking for a towel bar, expect it to be 24 inch possibly 18 inch, but just note that if it's neither of those, these other, sorry, these other sizes are available from the manufacturer. Then there's a pull and push uh, bar combination here as well. The pull bar, the pull handle center to center is the first dimension, six or eight inch, and then you have your other options here, 18 or 24 inch. Uh, if you have a horizontal center to center unusual, um, we'll need to order something from another manufacturer to give you that common area mounting that's here. You can't just take a regular push and a regular pull and mount them together. They won't, it won't work that way. The bolt package is different. The preparation to the pull is different. Uh, has that added set screw and then the bolt changes. Okay. Now, before we dive into the rest of the catalog, let's go here. There is a link here below this video to the manufacturer's page where you can pull up not only all of the AIW products that we sell by means of this horizontal navigation here, but also a link to the manufacturer's website as well as a link to that full product catalog. I would recommend a review of this because Rockwell or AIW is a provider of very good quality, very good value, uh, solid brass, tube stainless shower door hardware. They're going to not have uh, all of the potential options that others might, but they're going to have the standard material, the most common finishes, the most common sizes. So you might want to look at their catalog because it very likely is going to be that they have what you need. And when it comes to hinges and obviously towel bars, other accessories, you might do very well by looking at their catalog. They're single and double knobs. These are shower door hinges that you will bump into occasionally. Uh, clamps, if you're adding some glass uh, panels in your enclosure, this might work for you. These are items that are used in the assembly of shower door uh, enclosures. Wipes, different pieces of plastic that allow you to seal or help install your different glass panels. And that's the catalog. Let's wrap up this video on camera.
If you are enjoying this video, please click thumbs up or like, and also please consider subscribing to our channel. Let's move on to the rest of the video. In conclusion, I would again encourage you to take a look at their catalog. AIW is a simple, no-nonsense company. Very nice quality material for what it is. Very, um, in my opinion, uh, there's a lot of utility in the product. Value, you know, you're a very economically priced, a very fair priced uh, sort of material that, you know, we, we keep some of it in stock. It's because it's just so common. People buy it routinely. Any questions on the AIW SDP 3 quarter 21 BS? 27 inch brushed stainless steel, stainless steel tube, towel bar or push bar, uh, I, or, or pull handle if you want to install it vertically, have at it, or, or any other AIW product, please feel free to reach out to us. And thank you. Again, thank you for watching. And if you've enjoyed this video, please click thumbs up. Please subscribe and maybe even send the video to someone that you know. Thank you.